In this video, I am going to show you how to build Docker images using AWS Code Build and push them to Elastic Container Registry. For this demonstration, we need to have ECR, Elastic Container Registry. Let's go ahead and create a new repository. Create that. So we are going to use this repository to push all our Docker images from code build. We need a sample project. So in my GitHub account, I have one sample project which is node app. You guys can take this as a reference when you guys do practice on it. In this repository, the most important file is build spec.yaml. Code build uses this YAML file to decide how to build our application. Let me quickly walk you through this file. So it usually has different phases like pre-build, build, post-build build, and the artifacts. In sense, when you start this build process, before actually doing the build, if you want to do something like I want to connect to ECR first, then prepare certain details like which is my elastic container registry and commit hash. I'm getting commit hash. I'm using this commit hash to tag my Docker image. So image tag and so on. So I'm preparing certain things before I actually building my Docker image. Then comes build phase. So I have given list of commands that I want to execute to build my Docker image. Couple of echo commands which says build started building Docker image and this is the Docker command I want to use to build the image docker build iPhone T the repository URI this one and the version and so on then we are tagging it after the docker image is built post build we are pushing that image to our elastic container registry after code build if you want to deploy this image to elastic container registry I need to uh, pass that information to the next phase those details I will be doing it in some other video but this video I want to focus only on how to take code from github build docker image and push it to elastic container registry so these details as of now not very important so you can take this file as a reference and don't forget to change this repository URI let's copy this guy edit change yeah the rest remains good for me yeah commit the change we have ECR we have a sample project using which we want to build docker images if you want to practice you can import my project into your github account and practice that the next step is let's use code build to create build project I'm calling this node app description is optional let's leave all that information so I want to integrate my uh, code build with github see for me I am already connected so that's why it's getting the information from my github account from my github account I want to select node app this you can leave so webhook this is optional uh, when you select this whenever there is a push in github account github repository i want this uh, code build to be triggered automatically 
for that we need to enable this checkbox and select the event for which you want triggers the environment so i want to build docker images probably i need an environment where docker is installed correct so operating system ubuntu runtime standard so image you can choose any of this for this a specific demo image version i am leaving it as default so this is very important you must select this checkbox otherwise you won't be able to execute docker commands inside code build service role a code build might uh, access elastic container registry it might access s3 even it might access some other services for that a service role is required so i'm saying create new service role this automatically creates a service role if you have any existing customized service role then select this and choose that option there so build spec this is what the input for code build the complete build process depends on this build spec file that file is kept in node app project root directory so you don't have to fill these details if we are following default naming convention if file name is build spec.yaml and if this file is present in project root directory you don't have to mention that explicitly because by default it means the same for some reasons if you have a different file name and you're keeping it in a different location in such cases you have to explicitly provide that information so artifacts so where you want to upload all these artifacts in my case i don't want to upload the upload artifacts to s3 i want to upload artifacts to my ecr that information is configured already in buildspec.yaml so i would say no artifacts here so logs if you have any uh, issues with the build for troubleshooting all the stuff we need logs I give some uh, name for the log group it stores all your build logs in that specific CloudWatch group. So randomly give some names there and create the build project. If all goes good it should create your code build project okay I need to do one more change one more change so before doing that change let me show you the problem and accordingly let me change things so start build project we have only one project now you can set timeout if you want to set any timeout source we integrated with github and this is the repository start build it would take some time i will pass my video and i'll be back once it is ready it has taken one two minutes and if you see the status it's failed you can troubleshoot that with help of the logs here. See, it's unable to uh, log into Elastic Container Registry. The reason is we didn't set permissions. Go to IAM. So go and check your service role. Yeah, node app service role see it added couple of policies but there is no policy which grants access to uh, ECR so go to attach policies so Amazon EC2 container registry full access in real time you have to customize this and keep it very restrictive to what your code build should get access to 
so attach policy after attaching that extra permissions you could say rebuild so again I want to pass my video for a while once the output is ready I will resume it has built the image successfully and it's pushing that image to our elastic container registry or before that completes let's go to ECR the image is successfully built and it is pushed to elastic container registry I would like to show one more so whenever I do changes to my github repository that should auto trigger a code build so right now we have a couple of things right so this is the recent one when I do changes to my node app in github it has to trigger the next one let me open some file randomly do change and commit see that there is a new build in progress thanks for watching